that was that was a lot of work. Why am I doing this with the mortar and pestle? Well, it's almost Indigenous People Day, and I wanted to feel Indigenous. Let me tell you, I'm not sure I would have made it in the Indigenous times here in California. Um, mostly because I'm a vegetarian, and I don't know if they would have allowed that. But here we go. All of pesto. Can you do this in the food processor? Yes, of course you can. It's gonna be so much easier. You could do it in a blender. You could do it in a little ninja. But this, I mean, it was a journey. Two different ways. First, I'm gonna use some cashew cheese spread. I've showed you this before, right? Um, I'm using this one. Delightful. I thought that would just be good with it kind of be like cheesy. I'm going to go like this. I'm going to go like that. Mmm. 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 And then the other one, I'm going to do this first. Okay. This is just toasted sourdough. It's nothing super special. Okay. Get it all over. Then, I made these tomatoes the other day. They're, they're literally just put the tomatoes um, in the pan with a little bit of olive oil, garlic, salt, and just stew them down. I don't know, at like 400 or something. First one. Mm, gotta get it like the perfect bite. Over here. Mm. Mm. Yep. Friends, you gotta just like use the blender, it's fine. 